and welcome back. This is Mega Blade J, and I am continuing my Let's Play of Custom Robo for the Nintendo 64. All right, so uh, last time we won that little uh, city tournament, and we won this wonderful, magical talking trophy. Yeah, it talks to me. It's it's kind of weird, but I mean. Who am I a judge? I have a clone of myself in my closet, so whatever. Let's go on. Congratulations on your victory at the tournament. <laughs> at the, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> excuse me. At the tournament. I wish I didn't need to go to work so I could have cheered for you with Papa. He wasn't even there. What the heck? Where will you be going today? Oh, I see. The champion is going to the station to be pampered by everyone. Hee <laughs> hee. Nice. You weren't even there, you jerk. I didn't even see you. But if you were there, I'm sorry, but if you weren't there, you're a jerk. You won the state tournament? Yeah, he wasn't even there. He okay, he doesn't work. What was he doing? He stayed home, reading his paper. What the heck? What the heck? Whatever. Okay. Good job. I've been studying a bit about Custom Robo and how it came about. Custom Robo is apparently a hobby that was born from industrial robotics. So, it has always used sophisticated technology from the beginning. Uh, Lambda Corporation is by far our country's largest, largest manufacturer. Naturally, it was already well known as industrial robot manufacturer. Okay, that's, that's good to know, I guess. I'm assuming that will come, become important later on, but right now, you are a bum and I hate you. Jerk. Let's see. Okay, so school's closed. Let's see what's going on at the park today. Oh, they're in a different position now. Nice. You're good at custom robo. Thank you. Aren't you nervous now that the competition will get a little tougher? Meh. I'm, I'm awesome. Shen is like an older brother to Karen. They're always together. Why isn't she here? Where's Karen at? My robo is silver. Funny old man types are really cool. My robo is Caroli. I use the same robo at the as Champion Mamaru. Hey Bladema, today I'm coaching some grade school kids. Will you be training at the station? I'll come by later and I bet Karen will too. Okay. Yeah, so of those of you who have not seen my Let's Plays, I do have a habit of checking all the old places to see what things have changed. It's a habit of mine. I don't know why. I tend to find good stuff sometimes. Okay, same thing. Same thing. Same thing. Okay, so I'm going to assume they all say the exact same thing. Yep. Let's check in on this obviously evil guy right quick, though. Oh, see, it's locked. He's doing evil stuff right now. And what are you doing in here? Okay. Alright, I'm going to assume there's nothing different, so let's just go on with the storyline, I guess. That's locked up, and I can't get inside there. This is probably some kind of battle score or something. That's City Hall. That's locked up tight too, so can't even go in there. Station it is then.
Got a lot of cool things. Hey, are you that guy who just started playing recently? Need some tips how to customize? No, I'm good. Same thing. Same thing. Let's see. Oh. Recently, the Dread organization seems to have become more active. Okay, there we go. I knew there had to be some kind of conflict. Like, it couldn't just be all tournaments. So they've got their own kind of Team Rocket thing going on here. I guess they're called the Dread Organization. That's an amazing name, by the way. They've been constant trouble in the background. I have a bad feeling. Hmm? Oh, it isn't Blade Mutt. Hey there. That story just now? No, it's no big deal. Yes, I'm sure they're not going to attack me later on. It's good the kids here didn't get caught up in something nasty, but... Oh, Blade Mutt. Congratulations on winning the city tournament. You have a certain radiant aura. Not to say my head isn't shinier. Ho ho ho. Way to go with your victory, Blademan. Woohoo! Oh, hello there. Blademan, was it? Me? I'm doing some maintenance on the Holoseum again. The Holoseum speaker is me adjusting so Barris can be here clearly. Alright. Let's see. Yo, Blademan! Dun, dun, dun. Talk of the town. Yes, I'm awesome. You don't know? The winner of the SCT gets to have an exhibition match with Mamoru. The Mamoru. Oh, cool. It won't be so awesome to... It would be so awesome to watch that. It's been so long since... Blah, blah, blah. This is kind of a public demonstration. Okay, cool. And I get the feeling he will wipe the floor with me. So let's see what we got going on here. Hey, it's that guy again. Still battling, huh? More battles, better results. Hey yo, how is he so strong? Huh. The city tournament is tiny, not like the Super Commander tournament. It's so huge to have to open up both buildings of Jumbo Stadium to hold it. It's such a large event because it's sponsored by the Lamba Corporation. Experienced commanders from all over will show up to fight. Oh. When you're in the air, some guns, bombs, and pods will act differently. Even a short hop is enough to switch fire modes and confuse your opponents. Attacking continuously with different types of arms is called a combo. One of my favorite combos is using a straight bomb to toss a robo forward, then firing a sniper rifle round in them where they can't dodge. Another favorable is to use sideways explosives with blah blah blah, pushing them far behind a wall so they can be shot. Huh, neat. The boy who but <coughs> the boy who beat Carrie is killer. Oh my. It's Sea Tournament Champion Blademan. You got such a cute face, I just can't resist rubbing those cheeks. Ah, <sighs> nice. You know that guy, Heyo? Something's not right about him. He was here earlier, fighting like he was possessed or something. That guy, Heyo, is a combination of raw power and incredible luck. I was blown away. Okay, Five Bucks says he's with this dread organization now, he has some kind of new robo, and now he's evil. Huh. That's interesting. Huh, it's very interesting actually. Now yeah, I'm good on that. No really. My friend's friend who was in one said so. Ooh, underground robo battles? So-called dark battles? Whoever started those rumors needs to... <laughs> Interesting. It's a royal custom robo that you can only fight in Holoseums. 
Fighting outside arenas could cause panic, properly damage or injure people. I get a feeling we're gonna do that soon. SCT is really two separate tournaments. Do you wanna know more? Yeah, sure why not. Tournament East Judas, Icy Area, Hostiles there of Ice and Snow theme. West Building is a burning area, usually magma in Hostiles. Oh, that's, that's pretty neat. Let's talk to you. Ah, it's Bladema. I've never miscalculated commanders by so much. But you know, analysis of your battle input will be completed soon. Very soon. After that, you won't stand a chance. Hey, I can't wait for the S. CT PPP. <laughs> okay, I need to talk to her to do this thing. Okay. Hello, Bladema. Heyo has been battling constantly for a while now. I've always heard long fights aren't good for your body. That must be it. That blasted Heyo, and after I did so much training. Huh? I lost, you won. You had more experience and won the tournament. The only difference between us was battle experience. Experience is the reason. But I'm not at, at the same level as you anymore. I'll fight you again. Oh my god. I get a feeling if I say no, the story will continue. So, screw it. Don't think I'll be an amateur forever. Alright. So. Okay, he's using the same guy. So I got a feeling he's gonna use like some kind of secret bomb me or something, and we'll see what happens. Let's do it! God damn it! No! Ah! No! 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 Get up! Get up! Get up! Okay. That wasn't that bad. I thought he was gonna be like a, an unwinnable fight or something. It wasn't that bad at all. Idling bomb. Spider pod. Long veneer. I think. What is that one? Oh god. Oh, sorry. I scared my dog. <laughs> sorry, man. I see now. I figured it out. It's customization. Looks like I'll never be able to win until I catch up to everyone's equipment. I'll definitely find a customization on my own. Get, get out of my way. Late month. Good. I was hoping the battle would be over quickly. Okay. How to say this? Karen's in trouble in the park. I need your help. Oh. I'll explain when we get there. We need to hurry to the park right now. That's interesting. Yuri, are you coming too? 
Huh? M me? I can't run very fast, so I'll catch up later. Go on ahead. Blayma, we need to hurry to the park. Interesting. Okay, same thing. Very interesting. Will we encounter our first Team Dread? Or Dread Organization, or whatever they're called. Let's find out. Oh, I got legs! <gasps> I got legs! Oh my god. Nice. I got legs. Leitma, hurry to the park. Okay. I was already going there, but whatever. What's the problem with your clowns taking the deck from these kids? You know perfectly well everyone takes turn using the deck in the park. Oh my, how could it... How cold and heartless you are to an old friend, Karen Boo. All oh, that frowning's gonna give you wrinkles. Hehe. <laughs> you jerk. Where do you get off saying, you disgust me? Gah ha ha ha. There you go. Blowing things out of proportion. We're just trying to get a little special training in before the tournament. How are we supposed to know a bunch of kids would be, huh? Oh. Blade must here? After such a bad day, seems my left turning around. Kind sir, certainly you can never have forgotten to whom you are speaking. I will be a jerk. What? 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 City tournament? Your first round? When? Me? Fukashi? Fukashi? Did winning that tournament rot your brain? But I do love these little portraits. Why not handle this problem with a match, Mr. Late Musser? Oop, that was acting up again. If you win, these rats can use the deck for good. Lose, and you announce who the real victor of the tournament is. Fukashi. And once again, I'm horrible at reading Japanese name. Oh my god. Oh my god, what? I'm sorry. Dogs. They bark it. They, bar they bark it everything. What do you think now? That trophy belongs to the strongest commander. Stop pretending to be the victor and give Fukashi what he deserves. Gah ha ha ha. Hold your horses. You picked a fight with me. I'm your opponent. Me? Fukashi face you, Miss Runner-Up, instead of Mr. Victorious? Like you're one to talk after that second first round defeat. Come on, Blayma, how about it? Think you can handle my challenge? Sure, why not? Me? I came ready. After you fight these guys, I'll let you face me. What the? What are you playing at? Three against one? In that case, I'll join in too. What? But isn't he supposed to be a tournament champion? Don't I deserve a handicap then? That's only fair. The nerve, playing dirty like this. Come on, Blayma. Beat those two guys and I'll let you fight me. Yeah, this guy's a jerk. Apparently, we'll only get the deck back after fighting all of them for it. I'm not sure what tactics I might use, but I'll try to give you some advice. I'm not very good at the practical side of battles, but I'm great at theory. I still have a long way to go to become useful in situations situation like this, though. Blah, blah, I can't read. Yo. 
Sliding shots are a way to get into cover when you fire a gun. Normally you come to a stop and can't move for a second while firing a gun. However, if you press A while moving, you'll keep firing a bit as you slide a bit as you fire. If you time it when you can wind up hidden behind a wall after using the gun. Oh yeah. It's pretty neat actually. Let's try equipping these new legs to see what they do. Standard legs. Let's see, flight legs, increasing air dash distance, and multi-jump height, but lengthening jump recovery time significantly. Oh. Uh. Let's practice this first, hold on. Do a little bit of practicing, see how this looks. Holy crap. Okay, this is a bit different. Yeah, this is good. This, this, this will do. Damn it. Come on, seriously? Oh my god, I love, I love this gun. I love this gun a lot. You know, I keep forgetting I can ram people. I keep forgetting that. One fight down. That championship title isn't all show. You mop the floor with me. Next. Pods, unlike guns and bombs, can be released while moving. Only a certain number of pods can be released at one time, though. It's best to leave one in stock in case you need to use it suddenly. Okay. Now I'm good. Battle! Oh my god, yes, finally! Ouch.
Oh my god, I love this gun so much. Bam! Flawless victory. Alright, just him now. You're definitely the tournament victor, as if I'm any match for you. Gahaha! I, your star, have arrived. Time for the main event. Go on now, get in your spot already so we can just get this show on the road. Let's do it. Yeah, let's get this game started. Behold, the power of my favorite robo, Dodi Kane, first hand. Once again, I'm horrible reading Japanese names. Let's see. The higher you jump, the longer it takes to recover after landing. Also, using air dashes, even at the same height, increase recovery time. It's best to try to land on a wall, behind a wall, or time your jumps between attacks. Nope, okay, I'm good. That's the same thing you had before, I think. I'm good. Let's see, if I remember correctly, this guy was hard to knock down. Damn it. Why do I always land on my freaking head? Gotcha. He actually managed to hurt me. Wow. I want that bomb though. That bomb was awesome. Oh, I got more legs. Okay. I wanted that bomb. Darn it. Oh well. My luck is so bad. I can't win today, even with how terrible you are. That fool drives me so crazy. We did get the deck back in the end. This whole ordeal with Fukashi has really gotten under my skin though. Blatma, Shinibu, I'm off to practice. No way I'm losing at the STT. I'll keep you company, Karen. Great. Good luck, Karen. Thanks, Ken. There they go. Karen sure is fired up now. Hmm? Something's on the ground. 
This is Fukushi's ID card. I must have accidentally dropped it. Hmm, what should we do? I say we rip it up. Hmm. You know what? I'll do the good thing and deliver it. Yeah, otherwise he'll probably panic when he knows that it's missing. The only problem is, where do you think Fukusha went? What I did was wrong. I'm sorry. I think I know where to find Fukushi, though. Do you know Padale, the princess commander who lives over the bridge? Every day he tries to get into that to the mansion, and every day every time he gets thrown out. After all, why would the ultra wealthy want a guy like him looking about? Let's look for Fukushi at Catalys. Cat, cat, Catalys? Catal. Catal. Yeah, Blah! Cadillé. Whatever. Yes. Okay, it's been about 30 minutes. Alright, uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, we'll go try and break into a rich person's house later on. Um, if you like what you saw, like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Custom Robo. Alright guys, bye!